Four dead after a train crashes into bus in Mississippi. At least four people were killed and 34 people were injured when a train crashed into a charter bus in Mississippi on Tuesday afternoon. About 50 passengers were aboard the charter bus when it became stuck on the railroad tracks at Biloxi's Main Street Railroad Crossing. The driver tried to get passengers off the bus moments before the train crashed into the vehicle. This particular railway crossing has been the site of several crashes in recent years. A Pepsi delivery truck was struck by a train at the same crossing just two months ago. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Trains run on tracks and aren't real good at stopping fast. Here, watch. Amtrak train collides with truck carrying 70,000 pounds of bacon. An Amtrak train collided with a truck near Wilmington on Friday. Luckily, no immediate injuries were reported. Train number 22, also known as the Texas Eagle, was traveling from San Antonio to Chicago, carrying 203 passengers and passing through Wilmington when it collided with a truck carrying 70,000 pounds of bacon. The collision occurred around 4 p.m., causing the trailer of the truck to separate from the truck's cab. The trailer was overturned and split open, dumping its contents out on an embankment. The cab of the truck came to rest on the opposite side of the train. The train's 203 passengers were taken to Chicago by a bus after waiting at a local high school while tracks were being checked for damages. Passengers scramble off Atlanta bus seconds before train hits. This security camera footage released by the Atlanta Transportation Authority shows the moment a freight train slammed into a city bus last week. Six people were injured after a CSX freight train clipped the bus on Wednesday afternoon. The incident, which happened in East Point, Georgia, a few miles south of Atlanta, was caught on tape. The bus was preparing to make a left turn, but traffic prevented the driver from clearing the tracks at the time of the collision. The bus was hit once and spun around and then was hit again, with six people taken to the hospital. In the video, passengers are heard warning the driver of the oncoming train. They urge him to open the doors and all were able to exit just before impact. This man was hit by the bus as he attempted to dive to safety. The bus driver was the only person aboard the bus at the time of the collision. Officials say MARTA bus driver Dwayne McGee was among the injured and is now on paid administrative leave. The cause of the crash is still under investigation. LA light rail train collides with car causing 21 injuries. A motorist and the driver of a light rail train were seriously injured when their vehicles collided Saturday morning in Los Angeles. 19 rail passengers sustained minor injuries. A metro train was travelling eastbound on Exposition Boulevard just before 11am. A Hyundai Sonata was travelling in the same direction on its right. Witnesses said the car's driver tried to make a left-hand turn toward the USC campus and failed to notice the train. The train connected violently with the car as its driver tried to cross the tracks. The car then became wedged between an upright pole and the train, causing the train to derail and the car to be almost completely destroyed. Its 21-year-old driver was gravely injured. Rescuers used the jaws of life to free the injured man from the mangled wreckage. The train operator was also taken to hospital in less serious condition. 19 passengers suffered minor injuries. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Skidding Texas prison bus crashes into freight train. At least 10 are dead after a prison bus carrying a dozen inmates and three corrections officers collided with the passing train on Wednesday morning. The bus, which was carrying male state prisoners from Abilene to El Paso, reportedly lost control on an icy highway near the West Texas city of Penwell. The vehicle next slid down an embankment before colliding with a passing freight train at about 7.30 a.m., damaging two train cars. While the two Union Pacific employees inside the train escaped unharmed, the injured bus passengers are reportedly in critical condition.